What is up you guys? It's Susan Morad right back here on Clever News and Selena Gomez just revealed what her exes think of her in a new YouTube collab with Nikki Tutorials. And Selena didn't hold back. She spilled all the tea. So Selena Gomez and Nikki Tutorials just came together for a YouTube video where they did their full faces using Selena's Rare Beauty line and Nikki's Beauty Bay palette. They were both so excited about each other's new products and the video honestly made me want to try everything out. But aside from just doing their makeup, Selena and Nikki also got to talk about a ton during the 33 minute glam sesh. They spoke about everything from beauty standards to Selena's favorite makeup looks over the years to how makeup is therapy and they even gave some juicy details about their personal lives. Early on in the collab, Selena spoke about how she first learned about makeup from her mom and how she used to play with her mom's makeup when she was little. She also talked about what it's been like to grow up in the public eye, especially when it comes to things like getting paparazzi. Paparazzi, I, I'm not really a big fan. I, and I think me, I think I'm like, I got a special target on my head. I feel like people are assuming or expecting this huge thing from me and it's like, what do you guys not know, honestly? <laughs> Selena and Nikki also talked about some of her favorite makeup looks from over the years by her makeup artist, Hung Van Gogh, including this burgundy moment from the 2015 American Music Awards. Oh, and this lime green look from a Puma campaign last year. Selena revealed that she's so close with Hung that he already knows he'll be doing her makeup for her future wedding one day. Like he'll be doing my makeup for my wedding, you know what I mean? I love that. Which is... Which is never gonna happen. Oh, stop it. <laughs> but then Selena and Nikki got into their relationships and Selena revealed that she, like many others, has struggled to date during the ongoing pandemic. It's hard in quarantine. This is also not an invitation. No, it's just funny because I release things that like say I want a boyfriend and stuff and people like say that and I'm like, no, I, I didn't really mean it though. Guys are a lot of work. And when Nikki agreed that men are a lot of work, she gave a quick shout out to her fiance Dylan, hoping he wouldn't think she was crazy. And to that, Selena had the best response ever. Everyone of my exes thinks I'm crazy, so I don't care. So dead, I am so dead. Seriously, Nikki is all of us as Selena dropped that bombshell about her famous exes like Justin Bieber and The Weeknd. But at the end of the day, Selena said she's happy on her own, even after being single for the past few years. She said in her future, she hopes to have a family one day, but right now she's been focused on rare beauty and that's what she's most proud of at the moment. Nikki also went on to thank Selena for being so authentic when it comes to entering the beauty community and not trying to get on the beauty bandwagon for the wrong reasons. She said, quote, at the end of the day, a lot of people just see this as numbers and money. It's hard because there's a lot of celebrities nowadays that are like, we're gonna do makeup. And we're like, well, but it's good to see the authentic ones like you come up. And from what we've been seeing online over the weekend, people are loving rare beauty already. We're just glad Selena has found something she's so passionate about, as well as music, of course. And we'll be ready for that rare beauty and hung Van Gogh wedding glam whenever Cell is ready. If you want more on Selena Gomez, click right over here for another Clever News video and let us know down in the comment section below what you think of Selena's brand Rare Beauty so far. Honestly, I cannot wait to get my hands on some of it. I'm your host, Susan Morad. I'll catch you later. Bye, guys.